Welcome back guys. So in this video, we are going to learn how to reverse the position of the words in the given screen using Java. Okay. So this is frequently asked interview question as well. Question may ask in different ways. Like, you know, maybe they can ask, you know, reverse the word in a string, or maybe they can ask, like, you know, giving an input is this one, and they are asking an expected output should be this one. Right. So let us understand with a simple example. And I'll open this uh, Excel. So here, this is the string. So now this is the uh, input and uh, expected output should be this one, right? So now here we have to reverse the string word by word, but each word characters, you know, remain uh, same. It's not going to change, right? So that is what we have to do. So we can achieve this. Uh, you know, let us understand with the simple example. So first, if I want to do this, first thing is what we need to do is we need to split that, right? We need to split the string. So this is the first step we have to do. If you are splitting the string, what will happen? So now if I go over here, so now this is what if you are splitting, it will be coming like this, one, right? So now this is the position will be, this is in the zeroth index. This is in the first index and this is second and this is the third index. So now what is the question actually? Position will be, we have to reverse the position of the word, right? So position of the word means now here, this is the, you know, some coming into the third, uh, in the index is third, right? Now I want to, this word should be coming over here, right? So where it is that, here it should come, right? So the same way, this uh, index, second index should come over here, right? The same way this index should, uh, this, you know, what should come over here in this index, right? So now this index, you know, the zeroth index will be coming over here. So now this is now currently it is in the third index. Now it should coming into the zeroth index, right? This is coming into first index. This is second and this is third. This is the way the position has to reverse, right? So the character should not go into change anything. It's a character is everything is same only. Only we have to reverse the position. Right, let me do that. So first we are, once we are splitting, you'll be getting this one, right? So using a loop, right, we can achieve this, right? So using the loop, we can reverse the character of each one, right? So we'll do that. I'll go over here. So now I already, I declared that string. So now I want to, uh, you know, uh, I want my expected output should be this one. So this is very easily we can do that. So what we can do first, we need to split. Right, split is a method that is a building method, building function in Java. This is going to break the sentence into words as per the delimiter. So now if the split the string, uh, I'll just go to uh, split. So we can say str dot, we have a method called split. Right, so here we need to pass the delimiter. So now the delimiter is space. So as per the space, we need to split. So we can pass that you know, space over here, right? So now it is going to split, split the word and it is going to return you the string of array. So now I can store string of array. I can say st equal to, I'll be storing, right? So this is the string of array. It is going to return. I'm just storing over here. Right, so now I'll be creating a one more variable. So I can say string result equal to, uh, this is a string, so I can make it as a null currently. So I'm gonna make it as a blank, I'm not adding any value. So now using a for loop, I need to get one by one word, then I need to make it as a reverse, right? So how we have to do? So usually in a for loop, what we have to do, we'll be going to start from zero. Zeroth index two will be adding one by one, we'll be moving. But here I just want to reverse. So that what we can do, I'll be going from, you know, last index because I want to move this position word to the zeroth position. So I can start from here for loop int i equal to the length of this uh, string. Then I can say minus minus, right? So minus minus means it will be coming in this way, right? I learn. Uh, greater than or equal to zero till the zero, I just want the loop has to iterate, then it should go into you know 
uh, go with the minus 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 so that you know it will coming from here to this way then i can print this as it is so now we'll see that how we can do that we can use for loop int i equal to this st right so st is here list of string is that I mean list of uh, you know words so now i can say list uh, dot we can make it as a length so we'll be calling the one of the keyword called called length so length minus one why length minus one over here length will be i'll show you so now here length of the word will be you know it is going to return one two three four right so now the index wise if you see it will be going to start from zero one two three only right if it is coming four there is no value in the fourth index so that is the reason we have to make it as a minus one right so now it is going to iterate you know third index it's not going to the fourth index so length will be going to return four so now i greater than equal to zero till the zero it is going to iterate first it is going to start from length minus one what that is a third right till zero i just wanted to iterate okay now i need to go i minus minus because length will be four right then it is going to come minus one three three minus 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 means it will going to uh, change the i value will be two then next time it will be next iteration it is going to one and it is going to the zero so that is the way it is going to iterate so now i can say here already we have created a one of the variable called result right so now i can make it as result plus equal to this st st of i value so what is that i value over here this i value will be first i value will be the easy because we are asking asking that you know last length so that is a zero length this will be coming over here right so then we can make it as a six so now first time it will going to add that easy the next iteration the you know i value become you know three right two so now the next time this into second index value will going to add so the next iteration you know the first index value will going to add the next iteration zero index value will going to add so this is the way so now if i want to print i want to print the complete sentence so i can say reverse string or you can after changing the position so you can say this result this variable you can add because here everything you are concordinating over here only right so now let me run this we'll see how this is working so we'll run this So it is printing that we see very boring right so now if you want to change that value so now let me run again so it should come you know easy first easy is coding java right so this is the way you know we can reverse the position of the word Right, so this is very easy only. So now I hope it this will going to help you. If you have any other questions, you just add it in the comment section. So I'll add in the next uh, video. Right, thank you.